Default values can save a lot of time for a person entering data, which can be a real time saver, especially when the likelihood of the same data being entered for each record is really high. For example, in this human resources data table, most employees at this company will work 40 hours a week. And there will be very few exceptions to that rule. So to save our end users some time, we can create a default value in this hours table. So when they automatically move to this field, the number 40 will be entered for them. So all they have to do is accept that value or edit it. To add a default value to a table, you do that from design view. Select the field that you'd like to add that default value to. And in the field properties section, skip to the box labeled default value. And this can be anything. It can be simple text or a number, but it does have to follow whatever rules are set up for your data type. And since this is a number field, we can only add numbers. So I'm gonna type in the number 40, save the table and jump back into data sheet view. And now you can see that the number 40 is automatically added for new records. Yes, you can edit it or change it if you like, but by default, that number 40 is what's going to be there. And that is how you create a default value in Access 2007. Thanks for watching. For more great Microsoft Office tutorials, subscribe to TrainSignal's YouTube channel, TrainSignal Office. Or you can visit www.trainsignal.com for more information regarding our complete Microsoft Office training library.